Let's begin with what is a reverse proxy. A reverse proxy is a type of proxy server that requests network resources on behalf of a client from one or more destination servers. Unlike a forward proxy, a reverse proxy does not require any client-side configuration and all network requests are handled transparently by the reverse proxy. Let's talk a little bit about why you would want to use a reverse proxy. First of all, it's going to add an extra layer of security to your internet and DMZ facing services. Second, it's going to allow you to stream content from your internal network services to internet based users without storing any content in the DMZ. This can be especially important for those organizations who are subject to PCI, HIPAA, SOX or other compliance requirements. Lastly, it's going to add high availability and load balancing to your mission critical network services. So you may be wondering, how does a reverse proxy work? Well, first, the client initiates a connection to the target reverse proxy service. This could be any network service you designate, such as FTP, HTTP, or SSH. Next, the reverse proxy accepts the client connection while simultaneously opening a connection on behalf of the client to the destination service. At this point, the network output stream from the client is piped by the reverse proxy to the destination server, and the output stream from the destination service is piped by the reverse proxy back to the client input stream. This creates a completely transparent connection between the client and the destination service. Lastly, let's talk about how you set up a reverse proxy. To set up a reverse proxy, you must first download and install reverse proxy software. Jscape MFT Gateway is a platform independent reverse proxy server with installers for all platforms, including Windows, Linux, Solaris, and Mac OS. Thanks for watching today, and for more information on Jscape MFT Gateway, to download a Jscape MFT Gateway evaluation, or for information on other Jscape products, please visit www.jscape.com.